So, it's a cloudy, misty, gloomy morning here on the ocean in Maine. And today, Melissa and I and the dogs are going to drive an hour north east to the easternmost point of the United States. So we will be the furthest east you can possibly go in the United States. It's called Lebec, Lebec, Maine, I guess. Melissa, where are we going? We're going to the easternmost point in the United States. I already told them that. Oh. Go on cruising. Go on cruising. Later. Blue's being kind of shy. We are at the easternmost point of the United States. T-Mobile for some reason thinks I'm in Canada, but I'm not, I'm still in America. And we're gonna go to the Cuddy Head, Cootie, Kitty, how do you say it? I don't know, what do you say? Q-U-D-D-Y Head State Park, which there's a lighthouse and we're gonna go check it out. It's a bit foggy, but it's also a bit sunny. It's a bit cold, but it's also a bit hot. I'm kind of confused. This weather is confusing. Just make up your mind, weather. How the heck do you pronounce that? Quaddy? Quaddy Head? Quaddy Head? Quaddy Head State Park? Quaddy Head? Quidi? Qu... I don't know. Hello. What do you have to say about this foggy lighthouse? Um, I'd say that the weather is bipolar right now and that it's trying to be foggy but it's also trying to be sunny and it makes it look very eerie. Yeah, it's really cool. This is a very eerie lighthouse. So we made it. It's furthest east as you can possibly go in the United States. And it's nice and foggy. We got the fog horn going right now. Pretty cool little place. Nice lighthouse. And now we're hiking up this, it's called, uh, was it Coast Guard Trail? Yeah. We're gonna hike up and, and see if we got a nice view up here. This forest is amazing. Sorry, SoCal. I don't know that I'm meant to live there anymore. I need the forest in my life. It's not enough forest in SoCal. It's not enough forest in SoCal. It's not like this. And there's right? earthquakes. So scary. Oh my god. I'm kidding. Earthquakes really are not a big deal. Let's go. I feel like this point is more eastern than the other point. I don't know. But, anyways, Melissa doesn't believe me, but I can see England England from here. Wrong. Look, it's right here. No. Through the fog, you can barely see England. We made it. No, we didn't. Nailed it. No, we didn't. Don't listen to him. He's crazy. I don't know if you guys can see it, but England is like right here.
All right, we are leaving the easternmost point, Quaddy Head Lighthouse, Quaddy Head. We still didn't figure out how you're supposed to say it, but we'll ask somebody in the next town. Heading on to Lubeck right now. So Jesse thinks people that live in Maine are called maniacs, and I say that they are called Mainers because that's what they're called. Well, but that's what I like calling them is maniacs. Maniacs. And they're not really maniacs in like the crazy sense. It's just, it has a nice ring to it. Actually, everyone up here is extremely nice. Everyone's Canada, super duper nice. Maybe it's because we're so close to Canada, it rubs off, or maybe they like taught Canada how to be so nice. I don't know, because like everybody up here is very nice. Maybe it's just so beautiful up here that everybody is super happy. I, I will agree with that. I could be a maniac. Can we a maniac? Yeah. You are a maniac. But the, not the kind that they are. In the crazy sense of the uh, word. All right, okay. I, I like All the right. term Mainers. That's what they call themselves. Is it really though? I'm pretty sure Mainers. I don't know. We'll ask Mark. We'll ask Mark and Ellen. I'm pretty back. sure I read that in a magazine that they're called mm -hmm. Mainers. Yes. Yes. Anyways, we're going to Lubeck. Lubeck. We're going to see if maybe we can get, get a little snack, get some lunch or something. If not, we'll cruise around the town, which I think the town is like a couple buildings, so it'll be quick. <laughs> <laughs> we have a very quick tour. So, so that's the border right there. We were just driving and all of a sudden we were like, oops, can't go straight because Jesse doesn't have his passport. <laughs> we made it to Lebec. It's the easternmost point. And across the water over here, you can see Canada. Pretty cool that we drove here. Over there you can see Canadian Lighthouse and a Canadian RVer. We're telling everybody where we are. America, Canada. America, Canada, eh? America, eh? Football, hockey. We all know hockey is a better sport. Look at us, both with our Boston that's, Bruins shirts. Hey, hey, that's the only thing Canada has, is hockey. Whoa, whoa, not true. Canada has lots of cool things. Like hockey and hockey players. That's it. They got grizzlies. We got grizzlies. That's true. 